Welcome to Chemistry Tutorial 360. This is ammonia, this is nitric oxide, this is nitrogen and this is water. So to balance this reaction, I will draw a table like this. Now I will count the nitrogen on the left hand side of this reaction or, product, uh, or reactant side. And this is product side. So on the reactant side, we have two nitrogen, right? One plus one. Here one, here one. So we have here two nitrogen. Here we have three hydrogen, right? And here we have one oxygen. On the right hand side we have two nitrogen. We have two hydrogen. And we have one oxygen. So, on the left hand side we have two, two nitrogen, on the right hand side two nitrogen, so nitrogen is balanced, on the, uh, but here we have three hydrogen and here we have two hydrogen, so hydrogen is not balanced. Usually we balance the oxygen at last, but if we feel any difficulty then <coughs> we can uh, balance the oxygen before nitrogen or hydrogen, however, that is exceptional case. So to balance the hydrogen, I can multiply here by 2 that gives me 6 and to balance the hydrogen, I can multiply here by 3 that gives me 6, right? <clears throat> if you multiply here by 2, then these two will come before this hydrogen that is here, right? Okay, if you put here 2, the number of nitrogen will be changed. So you are getting 2 nitrogen plus 1 nitrogen. Total, you are getting 3 nitrogen, right? Okay, let me write 3 nitrogen. Okay, if you put here 3, then these 3 will come before this hydrogen that is here. If you place here 3, the number of oxygen will be changed. You, are, you will get totally 3 oxygen, right? Okay, so uh, now uh, our hydrogen is balanced, but our nitrogen is not balanced and our oxygen is not balanced. If you compare, if you compare uh, to balance nitrogen to nitrogen, oxygen to oxygen, it is easier to balance oxygen, right? I can only, uh, uh, I can multiply here only by 3, right? Then, then this oxygen will be balanced, right? Okay, 3. So, these 3 will come before this uh, the, here, right? Before this oxygen. If you put here 3, then our nitrogen will be changed. That is, we are getting 3 nitrogen plus 2 nitrogen right so actually we are getting five nitrogen here two plus three five nitrogen here right so <clears throat> now our oxygen is balanced uh, our nit hydrogen is balanced but our nitrogen is not balanced to balance the nitrogen here i have to apply another trick that is uh, i can multiply here by five over two be uh, that gives me 5 because these two, these two cancel out, right? Then I will get 5. So nitrogen will be balanced. So this 5 over 2 will come before this nitrogen that is here. But, <clears throat> and this is the balanced reaction. But if you, well, many people think, uh, think that uh, they are compatible with whole number so to to make it whole number you can multiply here by two because these two and these two will cancel out and it will get whole number so to make it a whole number you have to multiply the whole equation entire equation entire equation by two right that that will give you uh, the whole number 3 times to 6 nitric oxide equal to 5 nitrogen plus 6 molecule of water, right? 
and this is the balanced reaction. So thank you for viewing this video. Be well.